hello everybody this is Fadali and this video is about the buttons in the flutter how we use the button in the flutter and there are the different types of button available in flutter you can have the flat button raise button outline button icon button drop down button pop up menu button and we do have a button bar and floating action button so in this video we'll be talking about the flat button so let me just write the code for it I want to put my button into the center of the body so that's why using the center widget and child flight and flight button okay let me just show you the properties of the flight button okay there are the bunch of properties of the flight button but uh, okay what I do to make the things easier that uh, you should you know divide the properties of the button any button you know any kind of button uh, any kind of button into the two portions okay the one portion is of the functionality and the other portion is of the UI so divide the properties of the button into the two portions the functionality and the design so in functionality we do have a couple of you know the functions we have the on press function and on long press function and uh, on highlight change okay so these are the you know the three function uh, and it could be you know the more or the less in the depending on the type of the button or maybe same other most of the properties are related to the ui of the button all right user interference of the button so uh, let me just first write uh, the child i want to put a text here So this is your flat button and it looks disabled now you can give it a color okay remember one point here required property in the button is on press button so you must have to give on press property uh, to use the flat button otherwise it will behave as a disabled button and even when I just give color to the button it won't give you any change into the color because it is uh, into the kind of you know disabled mode so when you give it a on press functionality i have uh, done nothing in the functionality but i have used the on press function right now so it is now uh, a activated button or a button that we can use or button we can add the functionality in it so now it is taking up the color as well so the two main functions are here on long press and the on press and we also have the on highlight chain okay but we won't be using it we only uh, we are only using the on long and on press so in on press i'm just printing out and in the long press we are writing the long hello world all right so let me just run this code and now you would see that whenever i press the button it will print you out the hello world because I have given it a functionality that whenever I press the button print the hello world and when I do the long press uh, print long hello world alright alright so this is the functionality portion of your button alright now we also have the design properties but I think we should not care about the uh, design properties much because you can easily figure this out if these are the easy things okay what do we have then in design properties you have the button text stream, the uh, text color, and the color which we have used, the disable color, focus color, hover color, you know the highlight color, splash color, brightness, and padding and the visual density and and also the shape border, clip behavior. We have the bunch of properties that are related to the UI of the button, but the major properties or the main property or the functionality properties are only two or three. If you just could understand these functionality properties uh, you just know how a button works and all the other properties are related to is ui so for the ui we're just changing the text color i want the text color you could uh, design a color to the white all right so this is how it works and this is all about the flat button but uh one more thing in it that uh, i have seen that in documentation that the flat button is an obsolete now now use the text button instead of the flat button uh, look at this you know the lines the flat button the raise button and the outline button have been replaced by the text button elevated button and the 
outline button okay so i will be explaining it to you each one of it each six of these classes but uh, maybe whenever you watch this video uh, these three buttons the flared rest and the outline uh, have been removed and replaced by the text button elevated and outline but we will be discussing each of uh, these six buttons six type of buttons uh, don't worry about it I will be talking about the text button in the next video and it is just same as the flat button but you know we will have a look at it so this is all for this video if you really find it helpful and useful hit the like button and subscribe to the channel and bye bye